and next to a bombshell over another Southern icon, Atticus Finch, the shining symbol of social justice in the American classic To Kill a Mockingbird, may have a dark secret that's about to be revealed in a much anticipated new book. And as ABC's John Donvan reports, it is sending shockwaves across the literary world tonight. This is the Atticus Finch we know and love, epitomized by Gregory Peck in the movie by the same name, The Father oh, Fighting for Truth and Fairness. The Atticus in Lee's new novel, Go Set a Watchman, according to excerpts in the New York Times, sounds like a racist in touch with the Ku Klux Klan. To see that person in a negative light would probably be a lot different, and I might not be able to finish the book. For a fictional character, the response now feels awfully real, as in this from Twitter. It's like finding out Santa Claus beats his reindeer. Harper Lee waited 55 years years to publish her second novel, one that appears to have been an early draft of Mockingbird. The new book comes out on Tuesday. Mary McDonough Murphy, who made a documentary called Mockingbird, has her own theories about the story told in that until now unseen version. This is a first work. It's an early work. It's much more forcefully political and much more strictly a civil rights novel. It gives us a lot of insight into what her thinking was in the mid-50s. How upset are readers? Some, plenty. Another tweet, I refuse to read any book that makes Atticus Finch a bad guy. Well, that's one way to see it. The other is this, this Atticus Finch will always be there on film and between the covers of this American classic. John Donvan, ABC News, Washington.